Dean and Rector of the Holy Trinity Cathedral, Reverend Shelley Antonia, is hopeful that the emergency work on the structure will be completed soon. We still have a few more things to do. We need to finish the inside um, ceiling um, woodwork just to make sure all of that is safe and to finish the um, perimeter walls, the outside walls, the checking of those walls thoroughly. Um, at this point, what needs to happen um, is that we do need to brace the east wall as a safety precaution, strap two of the finials, which are by the bell tower, just because those um, that stonework is loose and so we don't want it falling. Reverend Tania thanked those who assisted. We give thanks, great thanks um, to Junior Sami for coming yesterday and assisting with the removal of some of the big bowlers from off the roof as well as taking down the orb and cross that was on the bell tower that was leaning because that was making us a little nervous. At this point the emergency works are in about the vicinity of about $900,000 and so we're working towards that. She noted point. that so the heavy restoration that works on the church long. building will not start until the new year. Reverend Tania said after the August 21st earthquake, a thorough structural assessment must be done. Anyone willing to assist the Holy Trinity Cathedral with their repair works can make a deposit to their first citizen's account using account number 1841216. She said those requiring more information can email them at motherchurch at gmail.com. We believe every little bit counts. Mass will continue at City Hall until the repair works are completed in November 2018. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TTT News.